Why is this lit up? Is there a light in here that I can't see? Yeah, there is. It's above the sink. Get out of here. Hey everybody and welcome to my Sims 4 land, where if you haven't seen my other series, we have the Sims 4 pals house, which has a couple of the pals in there, and then another house on the side which has some extras like sub, uh, guest, the last guest, and uh, Dennis's kid Daisy. You, you can go and see that if you want, but today we're adding Granny, that's right, the horror icon that has become Granny, and I'm going to put her in this tiny little house right here but first we're gonna have to create a household which means we need to make there we go granny is right there that is exactly what i'm looking for no it isn't we want an old lady that's kind of on the right track so this is a this is what granny looks like if you haven't seen uh, so we need the bedraggled hair uh the white gown and the horrific eyes maybe a baseball bat sorry it's your good <laughs> okay we want some sort of scary walk uh, we want like an angry, bouncy, creepy. Yes, absolutely. Okay, now hairstyle. We need long flowing stuff. I don't know about this thing. Is that part of the hair? Oh, okay, cool. It's not like this. Oh, oh, that's pretty good. Do we need white hair? Or oh, even better, I think. Uh, a flower crown? No. Uh, something that's quite messy. This is pretty good so far. I mean, if we just found the right hair straight away, I think we absolutely have. That was easy peasy. Oh, how about this one? I think that's better. I think that works just as well. Actually, it makes it look kind of a bit too nice, doesn't it? This, we'll go for like Sia. <laughs> Give her cat ears. Uh, interesting. No, we'll have, we'll have the long white hair. There we go. Now, dress. Please tell me they have like a white gown. Do you have this in just white? Please. Kind of... <laughs> Kind of not what I'm looking for, that one. Uh, oh, look! A wedding dress! That's kind of good! That is sort of what we're looking for. Do they have, in fact, a veil? We'll sort it by long dresses, actually. Mm, yeah, this is kind of kind of perfect. This is like a Snow White, uh, like, Cinderella-type thing. But this one is quite good. Right, do we have a veil for the head? Because we want to make her look even more terrifying. No, I don't want that. I want hats. Hats can be found here. Okay. Um, there's some Star Wars hats. A leprechaun hat. Uh, <laughs> a Libre hat. How about no? Uh, okay. Guess we're not having a hat. So let's get onto her face, shall we? She needs to look incredibly angry and just like horrific. So we'll go for really no eyebrows. Maybe. Something that's kind of messy. That's kind of good. This one. I'll go for this. Okay. And we'll tilt them. So she looks really, oh, wait, can we not tilt, we can make her look very surprised. Uh, no. Eyeliner, we want the biggest and blackest you can give us. She needs to have darkest eyes. In fact, let's just switch to the makeup tab straight out. We want eyeliner, yes. We've already done that, ah, here we go. Oh, that's kind of good, isn't it? I want something that's the most thick we can have, just, just completely black around her entire eye. They have a sort of darker thing going on here. These are very stylized ones. Uh, that's not available in black. This one is. That's just weird face mark. Maybe. It kind of does give a, a look. We'll get rid of it. Uh, this one, brown. Oh, yes. But I want darker. Perfect. That is lovely. Okay, can we give her like completely white eyes though? Maybe. That. Ah. Kinda. Red, though. Oh, that's spooky, isn't it? Hmm. And eye type. We kind of want the most open, round eyes we can find. And then with that, we're going to detailed edit mode and hopefully make them absolutely huge. Or, oh, oh, that's horrific looking. I don't like that. Okay, well, oh, oh, we can make it. Yes. Yes. That's horrifying. Make our eyes as wide and as bulgy as possible. Okay. Good. Can we grab the corner of her eyebrow? Ooh, we can! There we go. And then bring the middle down. Let me make her look really angry. I don't know. Oh, yes, yeah, she looks terrifying now. Okay. Lips. Uh, don't think it really matters. Those are kind of fine, I think. How about some lipstick, though? Yes. Do we want something 
bright red. No, we want uh, maybe a, a freaky look. That's kind of freaky. That's good. That's cool too. I want a black as dark as we can get with... Uh, oh, hang on. Hold on. It doesn't even let me choose the darkest one because it doesn't scroll down enough. This one. Black. Ugh. Oh, I don't like that effect, but it works lovely, doesn't it? Cool. Can we make her look even older? Face shape? Uh, doesn't really matter, does it? Chin. We want a big old butt chin right there. Lovely. Good-o. More makeup. Face paint? That's lame. We don't want any of that. Cheeks? Uh, no, we're fine for that. Do you want to give her some rouge? No, she needs to look as dead as possible, which is why we need to give her white skin, like the whitest that we can. Like that. Ooh. Ooh, it's horrifying, isn't it? Even... Okay. Do we want this, or do we want this? I think this one. Or bluey. Ooh. Kind of looks like an alien, though. We'll go for... Go for this sort of thing. Really? That's nasty. Okay, there we go. Good. She's looking terrifying. She's doing that creepy evil thing. Teeth. Yes, we want smashed, messed up teeth. Didn't even know this was an option. Skin details. Yeah, we want more frown lines. Yeah, we'll have freckles everywhere. More. Oh, we can't. We can have one. Yes, creases. We want the creases. Faces and skin tone. <laughs> we can change her kind of look here. I think we're fine with what we want, with what we have at least. Can we give her any accessories? Does she want some nice earrings? I think we will, even though you can't see them. There we go. Now, body shape will make her really fat. Should we, is she, is she like really skinny in the game or large? I don't, medium maybe? Really built muscly? No, skinny, oh, like slender man. Ugh. I don't like it. It's too creepy. Right. Hello, my name is uh, Granny. Smith. S-T-H, I wrote. Granny Smith there. And then there's some trait things, which you can see in the drop down here. You don't have to worry about what's behind the face cam. You can kind of see everything. We need to make her really evil. What does she want? Love? No, we want, we want hate is what we want. Okay, deviance. Uh, chief of mischief, public enemy. Nah, family. Wants a large family. Wants to create a family of vampires. Wants to have a family that succeeds in life. That kind of feels like what she's failed at, maybe. Love. I think she's trying to find the one true love of her life, you know? That's what she's going for. And everyone who comes into her house, she hates. So she hits them with the baseball bat. Okay, we need to make her angry with everything. How do we do this? Uh, a slob. Yes. We want to make her house filthy. Love it. That's great. Uh, hates children. Yep. She looks terrifying. I hate this. Loner and mean. Oh no, evil! Yes, evil. I'm really happy with this, actually. Okay, gender settings, anything here? Can the sim use the toilet stand? Doesn't matter about that, does it? I think we're good to go with this. Is there anything we want to change, maybe? Put her in a hot dog outfit, perhaps? Yeah, granny in a hot dog. No, that's silly, okay, good. We give her Princess Leia's dress. Maybe that's a bit better than what we were going for. No, I think the wedding dress works well. Ooh, let's give her some nail polish. How do we do that? Uh, hands? Uh, is it in accessories? Gloves? Rings? An eye ring? Let's give her a ring. Let's give her a blank ring. Some creepy gloves? No. Bracelets? Ooh, maybe anything creepy on here? This is creepy. Doesn't really fit in with the granny thing though, does it? Can we make it white? That's quite good. I like it. Oh, grandma, please! Put your dress back on! I was only looking for the tattoos there! Because I can't find how to do nail polish. I don't think you can. Uh, unless I'm just being very, very stupid. But I, I really don't think you can do it. All right. Well, you know what? I am happy with this. I'm going to lock it in. There we go. Here is Granny Smith. She, I gave her a, a bit of a frown. I elongated her face as well. Quite horrific, honestly. It's terrifying. Cool. <laughs> Should we take another picture? There we go. Lovely. All right. Let's say yes. Granny Smith, there is the Smith household. Lovely. Maybe we could add some other horror characters like Slenderman or other ones that I don't know of, or at least can't think of right now. Okay, let's play and let's suit up her house to be some filthy, horrific, broken mess of a place. Here she is. Lovely. I'm very happy with this, actually. Okay, cool. Hey, is this the original house we had for someone? I don't know. Okay, you can go in here. 
and I will turn into build mode and destroy everything. I don't know why I got it furnished. I don't want it furnished. Unless we can actually just change the colours of everything and make it look really gross. What's a nasty colour of couch? This sort of skin colour. That fridge? Nah. She would have maybe a white one. <laughs> that cooker? Nah. That colour. All of this needs to be some gross looking... Yeah, that's not nice, is it? Ooh, this is going to be a good one. We can make the floor look sort of like some really disgusting thing, maybe. Plank wood, that looks expensive. Chipper to bark. Rustic subfloor slats, maybe that one. Is there nothing that's kind of really bad? Gravel floor, <laughs> metal, maybe. Oh, look, you can have grass as a floor. I had no idea. Sand, concrete, yes. We want stained concrete. We want it gross brown color. There we go. That's not nice, is it? Which is perfect because that's exactly what we're going for. So, her floor looks like poop, which is great. Now for wallpaper. I think just this bland thing she already has is kind of good, but we could just do all drywall. Drywall, it looks too modern. Hmm, okay then. How about we go for some decals on the walls? There we go, good. Now we can start messing this place up big time, make it look really, really broken. Can't intersect with objects. I know, I'm sorry, game. Ah, oh, yes. So just like we did with the Pals Prison on the other Pals video, uh, we can now make this place look absolutely horrid with stained things everywhere, holes in the wall, cobwebs in the corners that you can't rotate for some reason, but it's fine. Giant ceiling cobweb, more holes in the drywall. We're just going to spam holes everywhere. I wish there was a random thing you could do to add this to every single room in the house, but we will just click and click until we can find something great. We're just gonna keep placing things. And of course, she's gonna live in the dark. No lights for Granny at all. Not a single Juan. Why is this lit up? Is there a light in here that I can't see? Yeah, there is. It's above the sink. Get out of here. Okay, any more? There's lights coming in the windows. You can't, does she live in a basement? No. Maybe we'll remove all the windows as well. Ooh, I don't do. <laughs> We're just being really kind of weird with this. Maybe because I've put it in the same world as the Sims pals, so they can visit each other. We might see her out and about just doing weird things. There we go. Cracks are plenty all over the walls. Broken things absolutely everywhere. There we go. That looks good. The inside is quite horrific now. We have stuff everywhere that's not good. And now let's search for creepy. No, nothing, no results. Uh, vampire, let's see what we got. Nothing either. Oh, filter items. It's over here. We want packs. We want, uh, there it is, vampires. Cool, now we have loads of creepy stuff. Century curtains. We need to go up one more. Oh, a big scary framed picture of someone. I love it. Where can it go? Right there. <laughs> Or can it go anywhere else? No, there's, there's literally no room. Ah, there, lovely. Okay, what else is quite terrifying? A Victorian bath towel. She's fancy, she'll have one. Ooh, an ancient bassinet, which I think is like a baby's crib thing. Looks good. Makes uh, some story elements, doesn't it? Because it's kind of creepy. I don't have much money, I'm just spending it. <laughs> spending away everything. An antique book stand, yes, that can go here so she can do her terrifying spells. All right, this house is looking great. We have a terrifying, ugh, look at that. And she hasn't even seen it yet. Come on then, in you come, Granny. There we go. That's right, <laughs> the way she's like, yeah, blah, blah, blah. I don't think we can give her a baseball bat unless we make her good at baseball. As you can pay, she's like, oh, of course, she wants to find her one true love, doesn't she? All right, there we go. This house looks quite gross with all the broken things, cobwebs everywhere. Glad there aren't any spiders in the sims running around but this is pretty good i'm happy with this so guys i'm gonna end this video here if you want to see me continue the granny stuff let me know in the comments below if i should add anyone else keep going with this what should i do i just don't know but if you liked it make sure to hit the subscribe button i'll see you all next time bye bye <laughs>